Do you remember the days when YouTube wrestling talk was a blast? Well, especially with the FUBAR 5 group, the old Off the Rope Show cast. They were all so unique, there's no doubt about that. Even made a legend out of a 30 pound fat sexy gray cat. Mm. They can make you all laugh or make you want to fight. Do you long for those glory days of old? Huh. Let's see. You damn right! Sting and Hogan at Bound for Glory. That push was a singular mission. Look, each can make this meat card piece of crap. I saw him got dark position! They caused quite a big stir with all those viper loving cucks. Exposed the world to the real truth. Fifteen reasons why he Norton sucks! They were always having fun. Yeah, sometimes their bids were the shit. But don't try and deny the real truth, though. You miss all them silly ass skits. The guys said lots of different things. More often than not, thought provoking. Not afraid to crap on the nerds and the wrestlers they were stroking. So somewhere along the way, they tried to do better. Instead gave birth to a dumbass idea, a fucking shitty ass newsletter. And they tried to persist. So next up came a channel hack. The content, but not memories, all gone. There's no point in looking back. So it was time for a fresh start. No crying out loud like a wussy. Their fearless leader moved to Virginia to pursue him some black pussy. It was time to build a new channel. OTR Central was the new name. But no matter what was tried and done, it was just never truly the same. His passion would come and go because wrestling came so damn bad Every time he took a hiatus, the viewers were all left very sad. Wrestling continued to get worse. No lower could his interest drop. Felt like the time had maybe come for the show to finally stop. Could it be? Was it true? The end could finally happen? Is that what you really thought? Nah, fools! Who the fuck are you crapping? All these fanboys spewing their garbage now. He can't stay quiet any longer. There's only one thing left for him to do. Remind everyone his pimp hand is stronger. About to run circles around these fools. Like he's Jackie Joyner Kersey. Time to fight more than ever. Show these lame asses no mercy. He's tired of these biased fanboys. Trying to sell that they're right. Here comes your one true wrestling prophet to show everybody the goddamn what! With all these videos that last for days, their bum asses are begging for money! It's pathetic who gets major views now. If it wasn't so sad, it'd be funny. Sucking up to the damn wrestlers like they've got candy on their bricks. Newsflash! They still hate you, ding dong dumb dicks! But kiss ass the fanboys have, their bias on the net has overpowered. Yet when called out for their bullshit, they run and block like fucking cowards. These clowns all sound the same, with their sheepies eat out peaches, all killing the business he still loves, have an original thought, you dumb bitches! So as you play with your file crackers, as you pull an all-nighter, how best to celebrate your wrestling freedom than with the return of your freedom fire. It's Independence Day. He brings you your liberation, and it will feel so damn good. Time to show all the IWC again who really runs this fucking hood. Time to speak the truth about pro wrestling. As you know, only he can. The Schleich out of his back, bitches! Behold the angry wrestling man! Time to fuck shit up! <laughs>